Hi everyone, I am going to show you how to complete this activity. Now this particular activity is for sixth grade end of the year review. If you are doing the seventh grade or eighth grade end of the year review, you are going to solve the problems and complete the activity very similar. Okay, so first off, before I get into problem number one and showing you how to complete the activity, on the third page, there is a place for you to upload your work. So what you're going to do is solve all the problems on a piece of paper. You're gonna take a picture of your work using your phone, and there's two different ways you can upload it. If you're on desktop or Chromebook, you are gonna follow these directions. If you are on an iPad or phone, you are going to follow these directions and you're gonna upload your work right here. So what I would do is I would go to insert image and upload from computer, and then wherever you saved it on your computer, you will click on that and you will open and you will place that image right here. Okay, so let's go ahead and look at how to complete the activity. All right, so again, sixth, seventh, and eighth grade have different problems, but I'm just going to go over problem number one for the sixth grade. So I'm gonna use a calculator, but again, you're gonna need to solve your problems on a piece of paper. And I'm gonna put 1,112.5 times 0 0.08 equals 89. So what I'm going to do is where I see the red question mark, I am going to type 89. I am going to grab the circle that is next to it, and you can see I have a yellow circle, and I'm gonna take it over to everywhere that I see 89. So here I see 89, so I'm gonna place it right there, and I also see some more 89s, so I'm gonna place it over here. And let's see, do I see other ones? I see one right here. And I'm gonna keep, you can see I have more than one circle, so I can keep just placing those. Now, let's say that you can't get it perfectly on the circle, so here's 89. Let's say I get it like that, and I'm trying to move it, and I can't get it perfectly on. Well, what you're gonna do is you're going to click on the circle to where it is highlighted. You are gonna hold down the Shift key and then use the arrows to move it in whichever direction you need. So I can move that so that it is right on top of the circle. And you can see this one too, I can do the same thing. I can click on it, hold down the shift key, and then press up on the keyboard, and I can move it exactly right over it, okay? And I can see I have some more 89s, so I would still continue to move all these over the 89. And then I will go back and solve problem number two on the same piece of paper. And then again, when you are done with all the problems, you should see a resulting image. You will see an image come to life over here and um, make sure to upload your work. And that is it.